I, I don't know what you mean. I'm just sitting here picking my nose. Ooh. You you look like that fucking guy. Who's the guy who did what is it? Manic trout bingo. Dush. Electricity. Electric. Captain Beefheart. It's, you look. I mean Edison, the famous Edison, who was uh, a way ahead of himself. He was. No, he was Captain, great. Captain Beefheart. That or road. Captain Beefheart. No, I don't know who Captain Beefheart actually is. I heard yeah. he was a small councillor from um, Hackney called Cyril. Is that true? Cyril Beefheart. That was his original fucking name. Moved to America and did what you did. Put a pair of sunglasses on, made his hair messy and fucking wore a, 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 a headband with a fucking half a moon on it. Little, he had a little beard like that, and then fucking not half a moon. Oh, would you look now? That isn't it. Sure, this is a third, more of a third now. Half, half would be right down the middle. Jesus, some people know. I suppose you think now it, it, it magically changes to the next day in the middle of the night at midnight. Craziness. Oh, that's fucking half a moon. Looks like half a moon to me. The moon, you never get a moon that's like a perfect half circle, do you? You what? don't get his oh, no. straight line down the fucking moon. It's like half a moon like that. Then three well, maybe not from your island. Maybe from your island it looks weird because of the flag. You can't see through the flag properly at the moon, can you? That's, my, that's where I live, there. That's my island. That's Umbrella Island. That's the last bit of the British Empire. Look, there's Britain. There's my island. That's it. That's where I live. Don't take the fucking piss out of my island. That's it. That's where we've retreated to. The last of the Mohicans. Yeah. Is there an ice yeah. cream van there? Yeah, yeah. Cream? Next to the Irish bar on there. All right. right, right. Do you have a chipper? A what? You can get a kebab there as well. No, no, no. You don't get a kebab. You get a kebab there. In that, in that You have to go all the way over to the flag to get a kebab. <laughs> it's quite. It's that actually, and it's. It's a long way from there to there. It's, it's literally thousands of miles. It looks close, but that little bit there, in reality, is like big bit. Yeah, we well, can get a kebab is, there. That is an inaccuracy, and it's also false advertising in that case for your flag. I suppose you're going to tell me now it's an, it's an iconographic kind of pictogram or something. Now, is that what it is? It's not a real representation of your island it's, at all. It's that it's island. An, that how, island. Do you know, how do you know what I'm going to say? How do you fucking know what I'm going to say? That island could be as big as fucking Australia, as far as I'm concerned. Well, yeah. It is an island. Or, or have you just got Tasmania? What is it? It's an, an island. Umbrella. It's, my, uh, it's my island. Umbrella island. And, and there it is. It's small, but it's not that small, obviously. Look, it's as big as my fucking fist. I couldn't stand on it. I, so it's bigger than that, but smaller it's, than Australia. Can significantly smaller than Australia. Smaller than the island of Ireland as well. I'll tell you that. Tasmania. It's Tasmania. I have you now. I know exactly where you are. And I know why you're in Tasmania. Because right. of all the beautiful women. Tasmania. Oh, yeah. yeah. I've only met about two. Not in Tasmania, you understand, but from Tasmania. Oh, dear. Do you know what? I've got a fucking fan there. So hot on this island, it blows out my lighter. My fucking battery's going to run out. If it's not one ah. thing, it's another. Well, we got 33 minutes out of that, and we did already an hour, which didn't fucking come out. That was. What are you going to do? Hit the phone. Don't hit the phone. Don't hit the phone. Don't hit the phone with the. Don't fucking hit the phone, man. Oh, that's better. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is that charged? We'll continue until we are randomly cut off in the middle of a sentence or something worse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's just continue. Don't destroy the phone. You need the phone. Especially... So it's really hot here as well. You know, it's hot everywhere. Is that because, is that because it's getting hotter? Global yeah. warming. It's working at last now. Someone told me 
but there was a small ice age as well. So, do you know, with the small ice age and the global warming, it should kind of even out. Yeah, I don't know. It's, <laughs> it's going to get really hot. And at the well, same it's not... time, it's going to get and really what? fucking cold. So, yeah, it should stay about the same, I reckon, yeah. And sure, what's all the fuss about the ice caps melting? Sure, the odd, the most icebergs now, you only see 10% of it. And it's actually more massive than water. So it melts and it's actually less massive. So everything should be grand, really. I've got to work. That sounds a bit like science. So you've got an iceberg and it's very big. And you've got water and it's really small. So when the iceberg melts into the water, it goes from big to small, like that. Yeah. Yeah. So how do you explain then that the sea, the ocean's so big, if water is small? Uh, well, do you know, I think mostly it's because there's too many people on the planet pissing away, uh, and that's actually what's increasing the water levels of the planet. Yeah. Too many people. It's, it's got to go somewhere. Well, what do you suggest? So we, well, we can burn a few. I think we need. No, we need we need central tubes, right, to lead up to the moon, right. So all the piss, the excess piss, goes in this tube up to the moon and fills the moon because apparently the moon's hollow. And then we can, then the moon will be a sewer. Oh dear, maybe that doesn't work. No, that's okay. Well, no, that's okay. It's very big. It'd take a lot of piss, wouldn't it? We'd piss, piss our piss up to the moon. Would that we mean send... we have uh, attachments? Well, we could then take the moon over to Mars and drop it off there for the uh, Martian farms. Because I'm sure that's one of the first things they'll want to do once they get to Mars is start farming. Lovely red dirt. Do you know? Must be, must be great. And they need moisture, but they need... You know, vitamin rich um, water, which would be piss. You know? Potatoes are a good one to begin with, right? Oh, definitely. Bring uh, on the potato. Up to Mars. Bring we have something to eat. <coughs> Chickens. Maybe onions. Huh? Chickens. Chickens. Can you grow them in soil? Actually, now that I'm talking about it, I, I think maybe, maybe you're on Mars. That's why you're surrounded by a Red Sea. 